in Tamil Nadu and other twists because AIA DMK founder MGR's niece Leelawati has joined the BJP. This has sparked chances. The BJP claims for its big entry into the state after the murmurings of its uh, having some association with OPS that haven't panned out into much in obvious politics just as yet. Uh, she spoke with News X explaining why she felt she wanted to join the BJP at this point of time. Her supporters have also spoken out. This is what they had to say to my colleague Priyamata. Listen. <laughs> ஜனங்களாலும் <laughs> <laughs> What made you to take this decision and why now? Okay, so we've been out of politics for the last 30 years. As a family, we made it a point not to get into politics, primarily because we thought this is not a family routine. But uh, this happens to be the 100th centenary for the late Parachi Talavar Injiya's birthday. And this year, we feel that his history might be forgotten. He left an impact of working with people and working for the masses and making sure that the state did a lot better than what it is right now. And that intent has been forgotten somewhere down the line. By whom? By every single politician today in the Dravidian parties. Because ADMK, Shashikala's camp or TTV Dinakran, they are claiming, the, uh, they are following the legacy, they are taking forward the legacy of M.G. Ramachandran. He wanted the party to be for the masses. It was supposed to be against corruption and against family politics. That's something that was the agenda of the party's inception itself. Now, the head of the party, as they call it, the Pradjayalala or the general secretary, has to be a unanimously elected leader, and that's been the intent of M.G. Ramachandran, the chief minister, the former chief minister, for a very, very long time. And that's something that's not been held on to today. It's become a lot more... You can have a dynastic succession if you have already done some work. You see, basically, if you have just been out of politics and the only claim to fame you have is that you donated your kidney... Uh, to MGR. I may have some sentimental value, but uh, if she if she is welcome to join our party because she has no minuses against her and MGR uh, was not hostile to the idea of Hindu uh, Hindutva. So uh, I knew him personally, so I can say that he was a religious man. Looks like this is the season for new entrants in Tamil Nadu politics and the latest to jump the ship is M.G. Ramachandran's niece and uh, his grandnephew. And interestingly, they have joined the BJP and are all set to fight against the AADMK and DMK. Considering that the political situation is quite uh, vulnerable here and there is a vacuum after J. Jailalita passed away, Many want to claim credit to the legacy of MGR and J. Jailalita. The, both of them have now decided to fight for the BJP and be part of the BJP, which is also trying hard to find ground here in Tamil Nadu. With media journalist Bala Subramanian, this is Priyamrada in Chennai for News X. Hmm, interesting. Meanwhile,